Hello, this is Mastering 347, your exciting playthrough of uh, Final Fantasy 9. And off screen, I did quite a bit of AP grinding. Not a lot though, because like I said, I get to switch between members now, so it's pretty hard to try and manage to try and level them up as quickly as I can. I mean, AP wise. But Karina, for the most part, she's pretty it is pretty much set. In fact, Karina only had to learn auto float and um, basically um, an ability of the twisted headband, which was um, uh, what was it again? I forgot. That was it. Gamble defense. That was it. The only other thing really was from the rebirth ring, but I equipped that on Zidane because Zidane's pretty much done most of everything else. Freya, she's almost in the white draw. Black belt also as well. She's still quite a bit to go though. Like, um, I still have auto reflect and stuff. Let's, actually, I'll give that to her next. Steiner, almost with a feather boot. Doesn't take very long, so I have to get done over with. And then probably something just high tide. And then actually plus, just, just work my way up and stuff. <laughs> Dagger, I'm focusing mostly on her um, Eidolans. I managed to learn quite a few of them. But it's just um, this is the Tobaz, which is Ifrit, then be Aquamine with Leviathan. But also, because I got the Angel Earrings now, this is going to be equipped on women, you see. Hold the earrings worn by women. And you can actually teach them Auto Region MP plus 20, depending on who it is. So that's up. Give it, so I think I'll give that to uh, sooner than with the other ones as, uh, as well. And then that should be basically be done for a while. This is until I'm done with um, Rebirth Ring. <laughs> And then I'll probably just do a bit of switching around off screen, whatever, and a bit. Which is great now, because by doing that, it's um, a bit more efficient to my AP grinding. So, besides someone who's pretty much learned everything, I only have to force them to keep him in the party, so I can switch him. The accessory that with Zidane. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because, um, you can never switch a Zidane out. But, anyway. Today, we are going to chugger bows. We are going to do a ton of chugger grass. But first, we're going to get a lot more. However, for the most part, we've pretty much done with the... Uh, we're pretty much done with the Chugo Forest. There are a few left, but I don't think not that many. So, we're going to look for a new place to look for Chugo Graphs. Which is actually along here. If you go around this part of the map, these little tiny islands, you'll find a new lagoon. Well, not, well, it's called Lagoon, but there it is, right through that hole. We can't go through it, obviously, because, well, you know. <laughs> well, obviously, because you can't go through with a ship. That wouldn't make any sense. You need to go through a chug away. So, we first need to find some choco tracks. Hmm. Maybe only around here. I remember them seeing a one small island. Let's have a look. Yeah, we couldn't do this before because the there's the reef is limited. With the boat that we have now, we can just sail along here until we find some, until we find a paper. There we go. It's chicken grabs right there. And yes, there's also another marsh around here. I'll be testing that next time. The next part after this to be completely devoted to pretty much greener. Because not only am I going to uh do all three marshes because we'll probably respawn with new um, frogs by now, but also learn some blue magic. Here we go. So now we can actually go around here, hopefully. If I got this right. What? Come on. Wait, are those choco tracks? You think I could go around there? Dang it, did I get the wrong choco tracks? Yeah. Hmm. 
Let me go a new perspective like an Avaduk. Ah, oh, there are checker tracks there. I can't believe I didn't see them. Hmm. Uh, I hate having to go around here. This I hate having to go around this lagoon. It'd be much easier soon enough when we get a certain ability, but for the most part, we can't yet. Uh, really? The no of way wound. Oh, wait a minute. Aha! Here we are. I think this is it. I'll be pretty angry if there's actually checkered tracks up there. Hmm. Here we are. Huh. No, aren't? I thought they were. Oh, well, I guess I was in the white then. But yeah, I guess you have to go for those checkered tracks. But it didn't go all the way long way round. But here we are. This place, right here. This one can be a little annoying. And be a little more tough to get through. But it's worth it to get for those checkered graphs. Here we are. Sugar Bow's Lagoon. Mean, mean. What are you doing here? I did some research and wound up here, Cooper. There's holy light cemetery of the forest, and there we can find geographs here, Cooper. Let's dig around some more, Cooper. It's tougher to dig at the bottom of the lagoon than it is in the forest. We can only dig in the shallow parts. Sugar doesn't like to dig going deep water, so the area's limited, Cooper. Okay, so make it half time, half price. So yeah, instead of I think about I think it's about thirty seconds now instead of a minute. So that's so I'm gonna play Chugwell Hot and Cold. Right now actually no, I think I'll show you what it's like in here first. To give you an idea of what it means by half time. Yeah, so it's usually a minute. So now it's gonna be like Oh whoops. Thirty seconds. See. Now remember to look at the back here as well. This also counts. A lot of people saw and missed that. Oh, you see? Much tougher. Oh, I got a trigger graph. Awesome. <laughs> However, though, because the area is much shorter, it's much easier to find stuff. And eventually, we have to we, the whole area will be access to us. Okay, come on. Ah, oh, yeah. It's much tougher. Well, we actually got a checker graph. Sweet. Okay then. So I'm going to do off screen now. It's basically keep going through here until I can get all the checker graphs I can. So I'll see you guys uh, a bit later. Jago says he can't find any more sugar graphs here for now. Cooper, why don't you go to the forest and you or use sugar graphs and do some treasure hunting? And with that, there we go. Huh, that actually didn't take as long as I thought it would. Oh. <laughs> yeah, see? Just like the water. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Got from sugar graphs there. Oh, not as much. But that's only because we're going to go through half the area. So I guess that's probably why it didn't take as long. So, yeah, cool. Okay. Let the, ch let the chunk of Chugo Bow uh, finding begin. This is going to be long. Let's see. Oops. <laughs> Wrong menu. Hmm. There are quite a few to find. Yeah. Let me get to that one yet. Nope. Hmm, which one should we look for first? So many. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, it's a Dawn Lagoon. I want to do this one because you get something very nice for this. This one's pretty obvious, but I want to get this one first in particular. Also, notice that um, that one is blacked out. Yeah, you see, there's a question mark in that one, so we can't go to that one again not until we get a certain ability. We can go to that one for quite a while, I think. Hmm. Soup. So the backtrack all the way along here. Uh, yeah, if I show you which way around it is again, for those who are a bit confused, because I was a bit lost. It gives it the other way around here. Hmm. hmm. This is referring back to my map. Whoops. Ah, and here we are. So I'll meet you guys when I find uh, exactly where that place is. See you guys then. And we are back. Ugh, this one was driving me nuts. But I really got confused and I thought it was another lagoon which I saw earlier. Which one I thought I could get to but couldn't. So yeah. Basically, just backtrack all the way to the Chuggo Forest and walk all the way around here. And it should be around here. Oh, wow! <laughs> if you go like that. Oh. Smoke, strange smoke appeared. Getting sleepy. You know what this means. <laughs> We await your turn. <laughs> Sugar, you now have the ability to climb mountains. You are heading towards your homeland. Are we home? Now, it isn't like in um, Final Fantasy VII where you have to keep switching sugar berries or something or whatever or try to breed a more stronger or be the one that has all the abilities. Even though Chuggo is now wed, he can still go to, you can still um, go to weaves and stuff. And you can still um, traverse weaves, but you can also now climb mountains. So yeah, he just gets added ability, which is really nice. But now we can just climb over mountains, like so. Yoink. <laughs> I'm the king of the world. Woo! <laughs> all right, look for that. Oh well, now we're the word Choco, we can actually do more Chocograph hunting. Back in that forest. Yeah, there's another secret to this forest which you couldn't access before, but now we can with this Choco bow. Now that he's uh, can climb mountains, you'll see soon enough.
You're flaming wet now, Cooper. One page. Want to, do you want to? Ugh, do you want to? Uh, well, there was only. What do you want, Cooper? Uh, talking too fast. What do you think? Okay then. So yeah. So you notice notice that um notice that um mean didn't say that all there's that all the trigger graphs were that were weird it's because um there are new areas we can access. So I'm gonna show you. Thing around here. We we're much faster now. It was much tougher in the water. It's much easier on the ground. Come on, no, is it? Ugh, it's embarrassing. Here we are. See? Ooh, we got a trigger graph piece. However, though, if we do this, we can go up here. Have a look around. You can do that with the other mountain there as well. This is an example. I'm going much faster now as well, and he's wed. So we go up here. You can have a look around here as well if you want. And that's basically, we can now fully explore this area and finding chocographs. Hmm, another chocograph piece. And there we go, that's how basic works. You examine that area where you walk near that area and you go up. But for the most part, it's best to look back at the ground. So what I'm going to do off screen again is basically look for the rest of the chocographs or any chocograph pieces we find. So I'll see you guys then. Wow, it's amazing that you found so many, Koopo. But you need to stop. I go out of business if you keep going, Koopo. <laughs> but yeah, I some at well one second as well. That is some that is insane. But if you manage to find eight items or more, then um, Koopo the mean will tell you to stop because you've got out of business. So what I do is I give you a special bonus if you just quit now. And when he times up, I got a sugar graph. A uh, gosh of greens, anointment, another anointment, eco screen, dead pepper. This is the other reason why I need to stop too, because this is a particularly useful item when you want choco. 50 gil, a high potion, and you also got um, a time bonus, 112 points. <laughs> Which is sweet. So now we get this. What's this dead pepper? Can I see it, Cooper? This is super spice pepper, Kubo. It was precious seasoning long, long ago. The mist wiped out plant that grows these peppers, though. You should keep it, Kubo. It might come in handy. So yeah, the dead peppers are used to find hidden treasures which are not which are not found and which 
which are not found on any chocograph. They are well hidden, but once you see where they are, you pretty much have a good idea. Um, basically, there might be cracks on mountains, there might be little bubbles in the ocean or in reefs and stuff like that. Those sort of examples. Hmm. And some of the cracks might actually reveal hidden areas, which are completely optional to get to. So, um, make sure you save with those dead peppers and stuff. You can also use them in battle to do damage. Don't do that. That's that's just stupid. <laughs> save them up for um, save them up for um, choker when you actually need them to uh, <laughs> when you actually find uh, a, a, a a cracked um, mountain or something. But anyway, I'm gonna continue on finding the choker graph. So I'll see you guys then. Choco says you can't find any more choco grass here for now. Choco, why don't you go to the Choco's Lagoon? Or you choco grass to do some more treasure hunting. Ugh. Oof, we found quite a few there. <laughs> okay. Let's go, Choco. Ooh, so now we have quite a few trigger graphs to find. See, we see you feed him a dead pepper to six of men. Can do a special move, which will uh, help him open something, but only in the right spot. So you know, don't just use them. You can only find dead peppers actually while doing the mini games, so you should use them wisely. Hm. And let's see now. Now we access the mountain. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, see, still quite a while to get to that one. Cold Lagoon, definitely. That one's available now because we now have Mountain. Hmm. The treasure buried beneath is uncorroborated. Let's have a look see. Hmm, that would be pretty tough. That would be pretty tough though if um but now that we have the uh, mountain chugabo, it should be a piece of cake, hopefully. So let's go find it. Hmm, let's see. I that's actually near Evil Forest. So do, 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 do. Yeah, remember this? This is the way to a uh, <laughs> south gate. It's another way of getting through, actually. I wonder how Dago and Steiner. Uh, you wonder how Dago and Steiner got here, though. Hmm. There's a snooker and airship, I guess. There you go. See? Now we can walk around here wherever we like. That's the forest. And that, and this other part here, is Evil Forest. We can easily walk over it now. So it's actually around here. You can tell by the brownie, you can tell by the way the grass looks, it's it's a bit more brown and patchy like. Uh, let's see, hmm. We're getting close. I need to edit this out at all because, uh, <laughs> yeah, I know how close it was. The other one I was having trouble with, which is why I edited it out for the most part. Hmm. There we go. Ten antidotes, one jade armlet, three wing edges, one cargo ship card. Sweet. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, where to go to next, eh? Hmm. That one you can actually get straight away. 
but you need to travel by a uh, <laughs> by by the boat to get to it let's see well I get one a bit later I get the ones who are closest towards this uh, miss constant it'd be easier first let's see hmm yeah let's try forbidden forest the forest lies where many mountain ranges from those Cooper you need to go over a very high mountain yeah pretty much at the center there of all those white lines as you see which represent the mountains with the mountain chuggler that is a piece of cake Yeah, I guess you can't walk over everything. Those are kind of a mountain, so I guess you can walk over that. It's actually, I think, around here. Ah, here we go. You see that little ditch here where the forest is? Here it is. Ah, got my first try again. Yep, this is it. This is it. Seven ethers, two elixirs, ten wing edges, and one high maid staff. Nice. That's each VV of some very nice um, black magic there. Mm -mm. All right, what's next? Anything else based on the Miss Continent? Hmm. High plains or grass fields that are found in a high elevation. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, let's go for this one next. <laughs> Actually, this one also gives a very nice reward. <laughs> let's see, where is it? Green plains. Hmm. I see it. The particular part of the beach. Do, 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 do. <laughs> ah, here it is. You can tell by the angle, but we have to go in a particular area. Hmm. There is around here in this part. Is it around here? No, but it is on the right spot, though. Hmm. Is it in between the mountains? Ah, here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Is it up here? Come on. There we go. Yeah, a bit annoying, but it is one area. Basically, you have to do it by right angle. It... Again? Strange smoke appeared. Getting sleepy. <laughs> uh, well, I might pretend to be surprised. <laughs> I knew this was coming. Wanderer, we await your return. Choker, you now have the ability to cross oceans. <laughs> you are getting close to your homeland.
Yeah, now we have the ocean circle bow. And yeah, you probably guessed it. When we find, you'll probably guess what we're gonna do now. I'm gonna go bow back and uh, basically find more choco graphs. And uh, except now that we have the this choco bow, we can explore the whole area instead. Then probably find another upgrade. But I'm not gonna go airborne with this <laughs> because yeah, this is how broken this cycles can be. You can easily get really powerful equipment, which I don't mind. But I don't wanna go completely overboard. Plus, this video would be really long if I did absolutely everything. I want to try and space out a little bit. <laughs> hmm. So I'm just going to try and look for a few more choker graphs. What I am going to do off screen is go back to Chugwell's Lagoon. It no, actually, wait a second, I don't know what I'll do. I'll only show you once how it works. And then I'm going to do that off screen. Yeah, because um, I think you pretty much get the idea now of how the choker graph thing works. I've already showed pretty much all the new stuff, which is all about dead peppers and all that, as well as going back and forth. But yeah, you see, we can now easily cross wherever part we want. Don't worry, that flashing blue part there, that's who our narcissist is. In fact, we can actually get to the next area of the game, just by using Choco now. <laughs> So here we are. See, now we can freely cross pretty much any ocean we want. One more upgrade we need to get though. Go to. <laughs> we were getting some of those for a real long time. It is tempting, but like I said, I don't want to go overboard with this because, yeah, you can easily get super overpowered. It's just ridiculous. But yeah, this is why I want to upgrade so much abilities because you're gonna get we're gonna be getting so much now after a certain point. It, it's it's ridiculous. Here we go. <laughs> you look kind of dirty, Cooper. Queer. Did I hurt your feelings? I'm so sorry. <laughs> but it doesn't matter what could you are, Cooper. You're still my choco. <laughs> However, though, now we can uh, do the whole game for a minute because we can explore that shadow end now. And, we'll, and look at look at we go. We are much faster now. See, like a shooting bullet. See, now we can explore this part. Look at this go. Whoa, we're on fire. Yeah, changing colors also very much makes Choco stronger too. Whoa. Down, boy. <laughs> it's insane. I didn't want to think how fast it would be um, back in the other, in the Choco forest. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, you see? Super fast now. It's, it's insane. Cooper, that's amazing. And as usual, here we are. Yeah, see how fast we are now? It's, it's nuts. Eh. Guess not lucky today. Not a single choker graph. Yeah, not even a choker graph piece. Nah. There we go. Alright, let's have a look see. Oh, so much is open to us now, it's nuts. Yep, see, we still got some to go. Hmm.
Uh, I can't do that one yet. <laughs> or that one. <laughs> Let's have a look, see. <laughs> yeah. Those, those ones want to complete your new constant, which I haven't even gotten to yet. So, yeah. So, I can't do absolutely everything. <laughs> Hmm. I think I have to split this into two parts. This chocograph thing I'm doing is insane. Okay then. I think I ended off here. I think I'll just go for this one. Which is basically, uh... <laughs> hmm. Which is pretty much the, um... <laughs> this is the other region we get to, but we can actually get this one earlier if you want to. Because this one actually has a shore. The one huge constant to the left there, as I'm walking past, there is no shore on that one. As in no beach, so I can't just walk across it. The only way to get there is by flight. Hmm. Which I probably could do if, um, with, uh, if since, uh, I could easily try and get, uh, trying to, um, get to the other Chagobo. But like I said, by then I get really overpowered. Plus the enemies over there are really strong. It, it It's just insane. I don't really go completely nuts over this. <laughs> I'm only going after this first one here because it's the odd one out. And I want to finish off basically all of the land ones. Get it done over with. <laughs> I could just go in the blue. The alternative though is that you could just go straight on the blue Narcissus. And there's and there's basically um, some Choco tracks around here which I can show you. Because I'm just doing this in the order I feel like it, I'm not doing it in any particular order. So I have to do a little bit later. But for the most part, I'm just doing this in the order I feel like. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, there we go. So you can just go on those. Hmm. Let's have a look, see. Oh, wow. It's right near here. Oh, I got the wrong beach. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's this one. There we go. Five ego screens, seven eye potions, three tents, and a feeder ship card. Any else around here? If they're close by, I guess I might as well. Yoink. Hmm, let's see. Ah, the cold lagoon. Well, a complicated cove. The water looks very cold, Cooper. Why would anyone hide treasure here, Cooper? <laughs> no idea, Mug. <laughs> no idea, mean. No idea. <laughs> ah, but yeah, this one. This one's basically an ocean one. I might well just show you what the ocean one is like. But yeah, there's no way I could get over here any other way besides an ocean chug away. But we have to go all the way around. Basically, where there's a complicated maze here. Sort of like a maze. There's also a town that here as well, if you want to. I'm not going to do it in this part. I will do it in the next part, though. <laughs> when, I do, when I'm pretty much... No, actually, no, not the next part. No, 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 because I want to take it with the, with the Chugger Road stuff. Yeah. <laughs> and let's have a look. See? Do, 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 do. It's around here, actually. No, nope, it's pretty much like at the back. Here we are. Yeah, you can tell by all the corners and curves we're in the right place. Let's see. It's one of these corners. Hmm. It's around here. Aha! There we go. Bingo! That one's very nice. <laughs> that means all the summons would do a lot more damage now.
but yeah this is why this side quest is so awesome but you can go overboard real easily and just pretty much get some really strong stuff which much earlier on it, it's it's insane <laughs> you can pretty much do almost this entire side quest that earlier on it's it's nuts not all of it but most of it, it it's still insane though <laughs> just just really crazy <laughs> So, uh, yeah, I'm going to end things off here. So, save. <laughs> so, what I'm going to do off screen basically is just um, get the rest of those chocographs or chocograph pieces um, in that lagoon. Yeah, I'll show you an example of it now and stuff. So, just doing it back over and over again just become kind of annoying. But like I said, um, you know when you're done with that place where Mark says um, you find all the pieces you can here, try looking somewhere else <laughs> and stuff. <laughs> hmm. Or well, maybe I should just do it off screen again. Yeah, decisions, decisions. Actually, yeah, you actually will do it off screen and then show you guys. Yeah. I see you guys there because I think Main says something. If you actually try, if you actually find any you know, all the choco graphs and stuff. So yeah, I see you guys there. Okay, yeah, looks like it's done. However, though, choco didn't actually say anything. Main didn't say anything this time. But yeah, choco says he can't find any more choco graphs here for now. Do you still want to play? Uh, no. There we go. We're done. <laughs> So let's see what new ones we got, shall we? Hmm, very few left. Hey, wait a minute. Oh, oh, we can't get that one yet. <laughs> yeah, it has appeared. Ah, I guess we'll let you won the game. Okay then, so, yeah, I guess we're off there. But next time, we're going to go after the rest of these choker graphs. Huh, we can't go after that one yet. I guess it hasn't appeared. Yeah. <laughs> you have to wait a bit later on or something. So there we go then. Next time we will be uh, going after Mr. Chocographs. I don't think there are any more left back at uh, the Choco Forest, but I'll check off screen. If there are, then I'll pretty much do them off screen and then I start recording saying I found more or something like that. Just to save time. And also be less editing for me. <laughs> But we found pretty much most of the choker graphs in the entire. We found most of the choker graphs um, in the game through that in the, the hot and cold mini game. We see to find the treasures in the choker graphs. Just we found most, but we still have some to go. <laughs> but we're getting there. We're getting there. So yep, next time I'm going to find most of uh, the, I guess, uh, most of the, uh, I guess, um, pretty much the rest of the, some of the sea choker graphs, and maybe some of the mountain ones, and the rest of the reef as well. But, with that, it says Mass Room 347, Game to a Titan RPG the platformer, stay classy. <laughs> <laughs>